Partial dentures are dentures that replace some of your teeth. Partial dentures can clip around your existing teeth to help to hold the, them in place or via suction if they cover the palate. You can have a partial denture if you have teeth missing on different sides of your mouth. The denture would expand from one side to the other side of your mouth. You can have an immediate denture straight after an extraction. So you can have a tooth taken out and an immediate denture placed straight in. You may find that over time the gums can change. For example, if you've had a tooth taken out, then that socket will then heal and the gum will probably scar and recede. As it recedes, you'll probably find that that immediate denture may become loose. The healing process usually takes around three months. So after three months, you may then need to return to your dentist to have a permanent denture made to the new outline of your gum. If you're going to be getting a partial denture, then initially you would go and visit your dentist. Um, it would take anything from one to two months and they'd usually be four or five visits. The first visit, you'd attend your dentist. They would check all your remaining teeth and make sure that they are healthy, fill any cavities and um, address any gum disease or gum problems that you have. Your own teeth need to be nice and healthy to be able to support a partial denture. The first visit for making a partial denture would be the impression visit. So initially you would have some impressions taken, they would be sent to the laboratory and you would have some custom made trays made for your second set of impressions. Um, so you would return back to your dentist, they would make your um, second set of impressions and do a wax bite of your teeth. Um, you would then send all that information back to the laboratory and the lab would then send you back some trial dentures made out of wax. You can try these dentures in, just assess the look of them and the way that you bite together. And if there's anything that you'd like to change at this stage, it would be good to tell your dentist. As the dentures are in wax at this trial stage, you can easily make adjustments to them. The dentist will then send the trial dentures back to the laboratory and the lab will then change them into acrylic dentures. Um, these are hard dentures that you'll then be able to take home with you. With partial dentures, I would definitely recommend that you still need dental checkups. It's very important that you maintain the health of your own teeth, um, even though you have partial dentures. A partial denture should be removed every day. You should take care of your partial denture by removing it and making sure you remove all the food particles and any fixative residue from your teeth. You have to leave it in water overnight to keep it hydrated and make sure that you brush and floss your own teeth as well. You can get a partial denture on the NHS. It'd be considered as band three in England, which is 269 pounds and 30 pence. Partial dentures from a private dental practice can start from around 200 pounds. Some of the bad things about a partial denture may be that you have to remove it so it's not fixed in place. You must make sure that you remove it every night and some people may want something that's fixed permanently inside your mouth. The good things about having a partial denture is that you can replace lots of your own teeth on one denture. It is removable and you can still brush and floss your own teeth as normal. If you've got partial dentures, people will not necessarily know that you are wearing dentures um, unless you tell them. Dentures can give you extra confidence and hiding gaps. They can also help you chew as well.